name's Bethan Shaw and I work at East Morning Research. I'm going to show you how to do an emergence test to check for the presence of spotted wing drosophila in fruit. We recommend running the emergence test alongside the larval extraction to confirm the absence of spotted wing drosophila from your fruit. To do the emergence test, you will need a punnet of ripe fruit that has been randomly selected from a vulnerable area of crop, a roll of electrical tape, a clear container and a fine mesh to cover the container with. The mesh needs to be 0.8 millimetres in size as anything larger than this and the flies can escape. You can use any fine material such as offcuts from net curtains or even a pair of tights. The reason we cover the container with a mesh is if we were to seal the container, noxious gases can build up and will kill any of the life stages that are within the fruit. For the container I'm using a 2 litre drinks bottle that I've removed the top from. You can also use other clear containers such as punnets as long as there are no holes and lunch boxes. When selecting your fruit, please remember not to collect samples from the floor as these contain other Drosophila species that use decomposing fruit as an egg laying site. Put the fruit into the container. Put your mesh across the top. Use the electrical tape to attach to the container and make sure that it is sealed so there are no gaps that any emerging SWD can escape from. This should then be labelled with the date the fruit was collected and a reference to where the fruit came from. We then store this for three weeks in a warm place and check regularly for emergence. This then reassures you that your crop protection methods are working and your fruit is free from SWD.